Welcome back. On today's video, we're going to be looking at a cow named Candace. She's exhibiting some severe lameness and has an ulcer on, on the medial claw of her right rear foot. We're going to clean that up and apply a block to that lateral claw, that outside claw, to take the weight off and to elevate that medial claw to give it time to heal. As I work here, I'm paring away this loose horn, uh, taking care to avoid any of the inner structures of the foot. That inside, right underneath this horn that I'm moving right now, is a new layer of hoof that's beginning to form. Um, and right below that's the corium. So very intricate structures and uh, delicate structures that you gotta be real careful when you're working around. It's uh, painful right now. It's going to be a good one. Or a bad one, depends on how you look at it. One of the most important steps here to promote proper healing is to remove all this loose horn around the lesion itself. Any little piece that is still there that can irritate that, that open wound, whether it be an ulcer or a white line uh, issue, either one um, can cause that, that lesion not to heal. So the key is to get all that loose hoof away so there's no pinching and no poking or anything that can cause that ulcer to stay open. Now all that's left to do is to trim up this lateral claw and apply a block. This block I'm going to glue on to that lateral claw and it's going to elevate that medial claw, that damaged inside claw, 
allowing it to rest and to heal without having any pressure put on it from the ground or any abrasion from anything that it may come in contact with. This block should stay on a couple weeks and we'll check it again and see how it's coming along. It may need to stay on longer, but at least a couple of weeks. And that about does it. This inner portion that I just pointed to there is all soft tissue with an ulcer there, down there by the toe. I left this outside wall here as protection just in case that block were to happen to come off. I would have something to protect that ulcer area. However, in a couple weeks when I come back to check this, I will remove more of that outside wall and, and get it closer to its natural state.